The warmest of welcomes to all of you around the globe with us very shortly. And here we have Paris Saint-Germain against Barcelona. I'm Peter Drury, and seated in the experts' hot seat is our man Jim Beglin. Hi, Peter. It's great to be here. And already we're underway here. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Well, I think it'll have to be England's... Hits one! Saved only by poor finishing. It was more possible than probable, and the outcome backed it up, Peter. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Phil Jones. And it's Perejo. Valencia. Phil Jones. Perejo. Kadira. Eriksson. Luis Suarez. It's Luis Suarez! He's got away with one there. Kadira going full tilt down the left. Stuck out a leg for a good challenge. Katira. Now it's Katira. It is deadlocked. Now it's Ericsson. Rooney. Mamadou Sako. Rafinha. And it's Barkley. Now it's Sturridge. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Neymar. Valencia. Parejo. Luis Suarez pushes it out wide. Back into the middle. Barkley. Now it's Sturridge. Steered out wide. Zaha looking to run onto it. He's got away. That intervention was very necessary. Rooney. Eriksson. Tries a through ball. Jordi Alba goes up and over. Chips it. Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! And Paris Saint-Germain take the lead. Marchetti reacted well to the initial effort. Couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Yeah, his instinct told him that the keeper would struggle to cope with that, so top marks for him following up. I think um, it's really sharp play, it was well read, and he was a little quicker than everybody else. Paris Saint-Germain take the lead, 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Looks to dink one in. Try to play, and it is a goal kick. Perisic, ball's loose, who's getting there? Barkley, played out to the right. Here it comes, he's left his man. It's a good run down the left-hand side. Coaxed out to the wing. Going through. Up to meet it! They've done it! Barcelona are back in business. What a great header, got plenty on that. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Deftly done. Looking to shoot. Good effort, and it is right on half-time. Barcelona close to setting up the perfect climax there. It really has been pulsating. 
You think we're up to after 45 minutes? Yeah, I think they'll be happy with that scoreline. I just hope the second half is as good as the first. It's been pulsating stuff. That's a really interesting game, and they head in at half-time at 1-1. Already up and running for the second half. No reported change to either side during the break. And it's Luis Suarez. Looks to slip it through. Sturridge. He's left his man. Out to the flank. He's got away. And that'll be a goal kick. And it's Neymar. Sturridge, oh, they can break here, going through, Sturridge with the ball through, Zaha plays it in, Marchetti claims it, what a throw in, now the pass. Well, it's normally around now that the managers think about making changes. Suarez passes it through. Rafinha. Barkley. Costa plays a clever pass. Zaha. He's left his man. Diego Costa shoots. He couldn't get hold of it. Diego Costa will probably beat himself up after that as the sole culprit. Takes it out to the wing. And it's Saha. Now it's Barkley. Barkley floats one over. Well, they're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. Now can he put it away? And the follow-up. Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! Into the lead once more. However, they tried to stand in his way. He just was not to be denied. Diego Costa demonstrated great strength there. I mean, he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away. And I think it's just top, top play. Paris Saint-Germain get themselves into the lead. Oh, it was a long time coming, but I think it's fully merited. They've applied themselves extremely well. Going through. Nicely controlled. Dinks one in. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Luis Suarez. Neymar puts his foot on the gas. Suarez. And the finish! Back of the net! Tying minutes, and we're all square again! Pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Suarez is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. All square again into the dying minutes. Ricken. Now it's Costa. Out wide to the right. He's got away, going for goal, he's scored! And the chances of winning a game that may have gotten away from you are always greater with characters like this player. A strong personality that has more than likely secured another big win. With time and space aplenty, he was never going to miss.
Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Paris Saint-Germain take what looks to be a decisive lead. Well, the last moments now, Peter, are going to be very fra... The final whistle. Barcelona lose by the odd goal. It could have gone either way, but that is no consolation. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Listen, despite the loss, they have to take something from this. I think the coach will have seen things he needs to, to work on.